but I put it out there because I heard the Pope and I respect the Pope and I love the Pope in many ways. I love, you know, what he stands for and I like his attitude. He's very independent. He's very different and uh, sort of a modern day Pope, if you think about it. But I put it out there because he was going to be at the border. And I said, well, you don't know, because he made statements about sort of me, I guess, or or whatever. And I put out a, a very strong statement that, you know, you got to take a look at the border. What's happening? There's tremendous crime. There's drugs pouring through the border. It's not coming from us. It's coming from the other side. And I made a pretty strong argument that I talked about the wall very quickly and it got picked up and, and he could have been persuaded. I, I mean, I don't know, but I really respect the fact that he sees both sides. You know, a lot of people are inflexible. They won't change. And I, I saw that he came out and he's, he is, hey, look, Mexico could stop the drugs in two minutes. Mexico could stop illegal immigration in two minutes. You know, you can't get into Mexico. You want to become a citizen of Mexico. You can't get in. Mexico, Steve, could stop illegal immigration we wouldn't even have to build a wall if they wanted to, if they wanted to do it. And by the way, if I win, they're going to start stopping it also beyond the wall. We're going to build a wall anyway, but they're going to start stopping it because they could stop it. They say, oh, come on through. It's like it's like they're a railroad station. But if you want to make a left turn and go into Mexico, you don't have a chance. Okay, You don't even have a chance. But when you want to go through to the United States, Mexico says, welcome, welcome. And probably, by the way, some of their bad ones, their bad dudes, they say, get the hell out of here. You know, why should they put them in jail for the next 30 years? Let's give them to the United States. 